The grand finale of the Active Aging Show, which shows off the performance skills of Taiwan seniors, was today attended by President Tsai Ing-wen. She said that despite her busy schedule, the event was simply too important to miss. Of course, she grabbed the chance to publicize her plans for long-term care. Seniors from all across Taiwan were decked out in special costumes and golden accessories, performing songs, dances and theatre pieces. Even President Tsai Ing-wen adjusted her tight schedule to make time to come and see the performers, who have an average age of 72. I felt I had to come because what I most want to see is our grandmas and grandpas as active as they were in their youth. Tsai took the chance to publicize her long-term care plans in front of her senior audience. The important thing about our long-term care 2.0 plan is in every community there will be a care center. Our elders will be able to go there every day to have a stroll, to see what's going on, test their blood pressure, take some tests, chat with other senior citizens, or even to have lunch. Another very important project is to link up these care facilities with the local hospitals. Next year, the elderly will form 14% of Taiwan's population, according to Ministry of Health and Welfare Statistics. In 10 years, that figure is expected to rise to 20%, which is why the government wants to encourage the elderly to become more active and to integrate the long-term care systems of local communities and hospitals.